Hi, I'm Sally Thibault. Well, we've had the most wonderful 10 days with our children, and in particular, uh, what I've loved most of all is the conversations we've had with my three adult children now. But there's one conversation in particular that really stood out for me, and that was a conversation I had with my daughters around the impact of social media on young women. This challenge that the, our young women, our daughters are now living with is something we've never had to deal with before. Do you know, when we were growing up, everybody had pimples and everybody had frizzy hair. That's just the way it was. Some people had big boobs, some people had small boobs. That's just the way it was. You know, and if you wanted to buy something, you saved up for it and put it on lay-by. Now there seems to be this incredible pressure to look a certain way and you see so many Instagram influencers and women in their 20s who are getting Botox and lip fillers, who are having breast implants and butt lifters. When did that become a thing? And now there's this incredible pressure on these young women to look a certain way. Do you know, every time I see one of those bathroom selfies that somebody takes, I think to myself, number one, my mother would be horrified if she thought I was taking a photo of myself in the bathroom. Not only would she be horrified, she would have grounded me for life. Secondly, you had to take so many photos and get them developed. You had to pay for them to be developed. There's no way you could take 60 or 70 to get the perfect shot that made it look like you had this perfect life. But it was then I realized after this conversation, these girls, these women are growing up in this brave new world where everything is not as it seems. And the only way we're going to change it for these women, these young women, is that we as their mothers and as mentors have to change ourselves. We're the ones that need to do the work on ourselves. We're the ones that have to come to terms with our own body image, our relationship issues, our confidence issues, our self-sabotage issues and our doubt issues. Because when we come to terms with our own issues, we show them how to do it. We show them what's real, not what's on Instagram. And it's also important for our sons as well to see their mothers being real because that's what young men do. They go searching for, and as you probably know already, often will marry their mothers but they need to know what to look for because what they're being fed at the moment isn't real. It's impossible to maintain. And this whole thing around this plasticity of look where you see so many people smile and they don't have any, they don't have any character. <laughs> they all look the same, they smile from their face down, their lips down. We need to show them the way. And it's that message that I realize has given me more um, impetus and more determination, more drive to get this message out. We, as their mothers or mentors for these young women and young men, have to be the guiding light. We can't tell them what to do. We have to show them. We have to be the living, breathing example of what we want for them. You know, I'm really proud of the fact that I do what I tell my daughters to do. I'm really proud of the fact that my wellness regime is easy enough for them to follow. I'm really proud of the fact that they see me age naturally. I'm really proud of that because I want the world for them to be easy. I want their journey through adulthood to be focused on, on their confidence, their ability, their intelligence, their humor, their joy, their energy, not on whether they're a si certain size or their face looks a certain way. That's why this message about lighter is so critically important. It is not about us. It's not about us. It's about our kids, our, ch our girls in particular, and our boys. 
They have to see this in order to know it. And if you think they don't see through your doubt, your fear, your insecurity, your issues around diet and weight, if you think they don't see it, guess what they do? They see it. So if you want to create the change for your children, you carve the way, you pave the way for them by being courageously authentic, your whole self, who you are, bring that energy, that vibrance, that essence to the world, using your individuality, your intuition, your intentions, and your informed choices. That's the way we change it for them. Click on the link below for more details. <laughs>